first, I would like to ask you permission to use this video for educational purpose and on the internet. <laughs> Thank you. Now, we are just about a few hours after the surgery, and you got a three-level minimal invasive transcaminolev with multiple small incision. Um, and, but let's talk about your pain before the surgery. Can you describe it to me? That, uh, I'd gotten a nasty Charlie horse about six months ago mm -hmm. that shot right through my hamstring and my calf and into my foot. And okay. then I had kind of constant pain after that. Constant pain. In, and you had back pain and you had leg pain, correct? I had back pain when I was kind of like bent over mm -hmm. a little bit. Um, but can you show me where the leg pain was? Um, you know, it was like, it was deep. Deep? In this calf. In the calf? And in the back, the back of the back thigh? Here. Okay. Now, uh, and you had it for six months or? Yeah, the real there? bad stuff. Yeah. Now, the, to, and what, one, to, one to ten, how bad would you call that pain that you had? It was kind of a real dull um, mm -hmm. three four, you know. Okay, would it get worse than three four, or would it stay there? Uh, at times, yes, it was pretty constant. Constant. Like before I come in here today, it was yeah. very uncomfortable. Yeah. Now today we did a big surgery, and you are just what few hours after the surgery, yes, right? Yes, sir. Yep. Okay. You must have done a heck of a job. <laughs> Why? <laughs> well, I that? mean, it's no small deal. <laughs> yeah, it was a big surgery, but how is the leg pain? The leg pain seems to be gone. I still have my. The by back pain? tingling in my feet. Okay. And of course, it definitely is back pain after the yeah, surgery. Yeah, yeah. No, the tingling we sometimes or numbness sometimes take long, can take longer to go away. Yeah. But if the sharp pain in the leg is gone, that is usually the best indicator that the surgery worked. Yes, sir. And so, um, do you have any pain right now in the leg at all? Um, no. No. Just in my back. So not the back from the yeah. surgery. So the leg pain is gone. Yes, sir. Okay, now, and I, I see that you have already walked a little, not much, right. but we are just a few hours after the surgery. And I see you have even had already your dinner. Oh, yeah. How, how, how was the dinner? It was fine. It was, it was kind, of <laughs> generic, hospital. kind of generic, but I was hungry, yeah, so it was yeah. good. So, overall, how are you doing? I'd have to say I'm doing pretty good. Okay. Well, the plan is you did a three-level fusion. You got three cages, three spacers, eight screws, two big rods. So, we did a lot of surgery. But most likely, first thing in the morning, you will go home. Okay. Most of people do. But is this non-metallic material? Well, it is. most of that is actually titanium. It's a very special metal that it doesn't build a ring in the airport. And So if I had an uh, MRI, it won't bother? No problem yeah. at all. Yeah. That's a special metal that is exactly made so people can get those yeah. kind of scans yeah. and so on. Okay? Well, any question or comment? What kind of recovery time am I looking at? Well, you see, as you just notice, if just few hours after the surgery, most of my patients walk. Even with three-level fusion, about 95% of my patients go home within a day. So most likely you'll go home. And then usually people after two to four weeks are back to basic previous life. But basic previous life is not going on trampoline or building a swing set. Yeah. I'm saying that because some of my patients have done that. Okay, and but bone grows usually about uh, three to six months after the surgery. Now, for traditional surgery, double, triple, quadruple those numbers in average. Mm, so correct. my patient recovers so much faster. As a matter of fact, whereas the hospital stay for regular surgery is about four days, most of my our patient go home in one and a half day. Mm -hmm. So about two and a half day faster, or one, almost one third of an open surgery. So I'm very optimistic. Yeah, yeah. What kind of job do you do? Um, basically, I'm kind of a ranch hand hunting guy. Ranch and hunting guy. Yeah. Well, we have to give it a little time to before we do excessive things, yeah. but we'll get you back there probably uh, within a good part of a month or two. Okay? That's, I'm happy about that. Well, well thank you very much for the interview. Thank I appreciate you. that.